Hey, what's up, everybody? Today we're gonna work on our exports on the Angry Birds that we've created yesterday. All right, previously. Okay, so now I have a lot of elements I've drawn here, but I'm just gonna focus on these four birds I've drawn. So whenever you export an object, you have to separate away from any other object. So I'm gonna do it. We do up this first red bird. Okay, file, export. PNG, okay, set it to 800, export location, okay, I'm going to export it to my desktop, okay, in your case, you export to your workspace, All right? so I'm going to export it over here as a red bird, and notice that it is a PNG file, I'm going to save this, next step is export, alright, Let's see whether the word bird appears. So it should be somewhere in my workspace. It's over there, the red bird. Right, let's do the second one. Okay. The blue bird. Export as. Blue bird. Save. Make sure it's 800. It's a good number. And export. Okay. Same, similarly for the blue one. 800. Export S, recorded location, desktop, workspace, yellow, sorry, light blue, bird, PNG file, save, export, and last but not least, the yellow one. And make sure it's in selection, right? It is selection. So we're going to export what you select. So 800, yellow bird, export S. Look for the location. Yours is in your workspace. So yellow word and save. 800 done. Export. Okay, we should have four birds. Right over here. Okay, I'm gonna zoom out. Now ignore the blank, the black colors, because it may just be the PNG file. Okay, let's take a look and see whether this works in our PowerPoint. Now once the images have been exported, it should be able to appear in PowerPoint, Microsoft Word, or even the web, okay, as an image. So, insert pictures, okay, desktop, workspace, let's try the red bird, yeah, it looks fine, insert pictures, blue, I can press control to select multiple objects. And insert. There we go. Okay. Why they are so huge is because each of them are 800 wide. So I'm just going to press Control. Okay. Okay. So we are done. All right. So it's going to lay it this way. You can right click if you want this guy to be in front. Bring to the front. Make him bigger. Okay, Angry Bird Family by your name. And let's bold this. Okay, then if you work, I'll save. Save as because it's our first time. Okay, browse. Desktop once again, workspace and workspace. Okay, this is CPA file, Angry Bird Family. Save. And we shall just close this. Don't forget your Inkscape file has also to be saved. So, file, save. Okay, so when you save is an SVG file. Okay, that's all for saving and exporting. So I hope you master this skill because without it, you will not be able to import or insert your pictures into any Microsoft Word or PowerPoint files. Okay, see you at on our next lesson.